everybody and welcome back to my channel. Today I thought I would do a video on some of my uh, china collection that I picked up at thrifting. It's all good china and they're all beautiful pieces and it's a fun thing to do. So I have so much of them I think I'll break them up into three videos and I hope you enjoy it. So this is my first collection of china that I wanted to show you and I wanted to let you know that everything I bought here I never pay more than a dollar a plate. That's my first thing. It has to be in mint condition and never more than a dollar a plate. It's amazing what you could find. This is my latest find. I have what's called a five dollar wooden nickel. You buy five dollars for it. It's, it's a humane thrift store and once a week something is half price. And you buy that nickel once, whatever's half price that week you can get. So I happened to walk in and found this beautiful set for $15. It's Lennox. And I did some research on it. So pardon me while I look at my cheat sheets. So I paid $15 for it. It's the Belvedere pattern. I looked it up on replacements.com. I found out that the five dinner plates cost $39.99 a piece, which brings it to a total of $149.95. Yay! And the saucers are $7.99 a set. I have four of them, so that brings the total to $51.96. Listed for $25.99 a piece on replacement.com, so that would make that $51.96. And last but not least in this collection, I have two butter plates. That's what they're called, bread and butter plates. They listed for $15.99. So that brings the total to $31.98. So my $16 investment, if I were to buy all of this on replacements.com, I would be paying $265.88. Beautiful Wedgwood plates. These up at Savers in Connecticut when I lived in Connecticut for a dollar a plate. Never pay more than that. And um, I looked it up. It's the Robert Spray pattern. They sell for $19.99 a plate. I have nine of them. That would bring the total to $179.91. So these beautiful plates are made by Johnson Brothers. They're English and they're called the Friendly Village pattern. So I'll pick this set up at Savers in Connecticut. Paid a dollar a plate for everything and a dollar a bowl. And um, like I said, it's called the Friendly Village pattern, but the plates actually are called Covered Bridge. And I have four of them. They list for $19.99 at replacement.com. That would make my total $79.96. And also I wanted to let you know that they were made between the years of 1953 and discontinued in 2003. The soup bowls are in the stone wall pattern. That's the name of it. Probably because it has a stone wall there. And I have four of them. And they list on replacements.com for $21.96. That would bring a total to $87.96. Eight of the salad plates. They're called Willow. The pattern is Willow, although it's still part of the same set. And they list for $39.99 on replacements.com. I have eight of them. That brings a total to $271.92. So I paid $16 for this set, and if I were to buy all these pieces today at replacements.com, I would pay $439.87. This beautiful cup and saucer set, Noritake Nora, Norma pattern, um, was made between the years 1969 and 1982. I paid $1.99 a set at Goodwill, they list for $9.99 on replacements.com, which would mean I would be paying $29.97. So these beautiful bowls were made in Bavaria. They're made by 
Johan Havilland, and they're called the Sweetheart Rose Pattern. I picked them up for a dollar a plate at one of my favorite thrift stores, and they sell for $9.99 on replacements.com for a total of $50 for five plates. Not bad for a $5 investment. These beautiful gold trim plates are called Staffordshire, which is a good English china, Royal Tudor, in the chintz pattern. I also picked these up for a dollar a plate at a thrift store. They retail for $40 to $50. Online. So I picked these up the other day at the SPCA thrift store with my wooden nickel. They were going for $3 a set. I got them both for $3, which means I paid 50 cents more than I normally would, but it was worth it because they list for $9 a set. Not a bad investment at all. These beautiful plates, oh, they're in mint condition. I bought them, again, I bought the piece. They're called a floral spray pattern. They're salad plates. They're Bavarian and it says Germany US owned. So that tells me they were made right after the Second World War. They list on replacements.com for $6.99 a plate. I have 10 of them, grand total of $69.99. I picked these beautiful plates up at the thrift store. These beautiful plates were made in the 1940s by Homer Laughlin, who also makes Fiesta wear, if that name sounds familiar to you. I picked them up at Connecticut at Savers, brought them down to Florida with me. I have 10 berry bowls. Again, I bought them for a dollar a piece. They list at $7.99 on replacements.com, which means if I were to buy them there, $79.90. The soup bowls, again, a dollar a plate, list for $13.99. I have 11 of them for $153.89. Beautiful plate. I have to give a big shout out to my friend Jojo, who when we were thrifting last week down in South Florida, I said, I love this plate. I love this pattern. I want to start collecting it, but I didn't have the patience to buy just one plate. So she bought it for me as a surprise. Thanks, Jojo. So a lot of those are going back in my cabinet, but I do sell on eBay and about half of those pieces will be going on eBay. I won't be asking what I told you they get for on replacements.com because nobody asks those prices on eBay. But it was still a great deal. And if you're interested in anything, let me know. That was my first of probably three Bone China thrifting videos. I hope you found it informative and not boring. And I have a correction to make. The Homer Laughlin Bowls, I found my notes. I actually paid $10 for 21 pieces. I got them half price. So come back and see me soon. Have a great day. to the moon and let me we're filming hi everybody and welcome back to my channel today i thought i would do uh <laughs>